Okay, so I'm in the uh, teacher edition of IXL. This is my student roster. I've made a new uh, student named Ziggy, Ziggy Zoosby. Um, I'm gonna just capture that information. And now I'm gonna log out. And so now I want to just take a look at that information that I just, uh, oops. Uh, Ziggy Zoos B233. So Ziggy Zoos B233. Password is Ziggy. I sign in and no, I don't want that. That's for me. Explore recommendations for blah, blah, blah. Oh, look at that. 59 skills suggested by your teacher. Okay. Um, so those are the skills that you should be going to. Now, if you go up Ziggy, you can go to wherever you want, math, English. Uh, you can look at our provincial curriculum. You can look at your awards as well. But if you go to diagnostic, hello, there's start diagnosing to reveal your levels. Step into the arena. Okay, and it once when you do that, it'll ask you to choose a question. I'll choose this one. Uh, looks like I have three rows, two in each row. That gives me six. I'm going to submit that. Uh, some bouncing colored balls. Ten divided into ten equal groups means I'm going to have one, oop, not eleven, one in each group. Now, the idea is that I go through this, and at the end, you're going to get a after about 30 minutes of questions, you, you'll get a uh, report. And let's see if I can pull it up here. Um, so, so this was me. I stepped into the arena, and I think I'm around grade seven. I wasn't trying very hard. And so it gives me a number sense, place, patterns, and algebra, geometry, and measurement. Uh, data stat statistics and probability and that's why I do want you to step into the arena so let's go through that one more time okay um, I'm Ziggy Zuzby and first I want to learn so I click on the learning tab right here there's 59 skills suggested by your teacher please do not go to the high school level math questions and uh, look at them and giggle please click this link and see uh, which one that's grade three grade three grade three maybe i'm in grade two so i scroll down and oh apparently i wanted the grade twos to learn how to uh, actually this is for everybody Ignore the grade two, ignore the grade three, just do these skills. Some of them are for grade two, but some of them are for grade two and three. So uh, I would say for these skills, uh, just try them all. If it's grade three and, and you're a grade two student and you're finding it too tricky, then you can stop. If you're a grade three student, well, then you should be able to do the grade two stuff already. And all this has been selected with the grade two and threes in mind. And, but I do want you to start in the arena to get your overall levels, please. And I would appreciate that very much. Thanks very much for listening.